Hi guys, it's Andy. I wanted to share my results of the three-day refresh with you guys. Um, I did it over the weekend, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, so I started the day after 4th of July. And what's today? Today's Thursday, so I finished two days ago. Um, I did it because most of you know, if you've been following, that I struggle with nutrition the most. So I was really looking for something just to help me get back onto a healthier track. Um, and I figured three days is doable. I can do it for three days. So I started Saturday. Um, I weighed 137.2, I believe. Um, which is kind of where I've been. And I'm okay with that because I know I've been putting on some muscle from P90X3. So really, I don't get too stressed out about the scale at this point. Um, my measurements and my strength and stamina are what I go by. So... Here is the most important tip I am going to give you for those of you doing three-day refresh. Fiber sweep. You have it every day in the morning. Step one, make sure there are no lumps of powder in the bag. Break them up if there are. Step two, split it in half. Do four ounces of water with half the packet. Mix, drink it right away. Immediately, do the next four ounces of water with the rest of the packet, mix, and drink it right away. Personally, I found that was the best way for me to do it. Um, it keeps it from getting too thick and lumpy, and it was just easier for me to get it down. Obviously, I didn't know that the first day. Um, so I'm sharing that with you guys, so you know. But I think I did good. It's, it's a vegan plan. You drink Shakeology in the morning with nothing added. Um, or you can add a a fruit from the fruit options. You do your fiber sweep, you have your vanilla shake for lunch with your fruit, veggie, healthy fat. Then you have your afternoon snack of a veggie with a healthy fat. And then you have dinner of the vanilla shake and one of the um, dinner recipes, which are all vegetable based, all of them. That's it, it's just veggies. And you can have um, a cup of organic vegetable broth with it. So I hate vegetables. So I was really nervous about that part of it. Day one, <laughs> I literally had a spoonful of coconut oil just off the spoon. I love coconut oil for everything. I use it for cooking. I use it for my hair. I use it for my skin. I love coconut oil. I do not love it just off a spoon plain. But I did it. For my snack, I had a cup of sliced cucumbers with red pepper hummus. And I put a little seasoning on, on the cucumbers. <laughs> I tried. I, I ate pretty much all of it, so I was proud of myself. Day two, I had lettuce from our garden um, for my snack, but I'm not going to lie, I cheated a little. I needed dressing. I can't just eat plain lettuce. But overall, I think I did good. Drank my fiber every day, drank every vanilla refresh shake there was. Uh, loved the fruit. I could eat fruit and have a Shakeology all day, every day. That was no problem. I actually substituted fruit. For veggies a couple times because I just can't I don't know I just can't do veggies but I, I'll do fruit um so I did good was I perfect no but did I do the best that I could do yes I tried I'm pretty proud of myself um at the end of the three days I went from 137.2 to 134.4, so just about three pounds, which honestly is the number that I kind of had in the back of my mind. I was not looking to drop 10 pounds because I don't think, for me, losing 10 pounds in three days would not be healthy. I don't have that to lose like that. Um, and I lost two inches overall. I lost an inch and a half in my waist and half an inch in my hips, I believe. Um, so that was what I was excited about. It helped get rid of the bloat. Let's see, can you see? Tummy's flatter. Um, it just got helped to get rid of that puffiness that's there from crap. I mean, I love ice cream. I love nachos. I was loving them a little too much prior to this. So this helped me kind of get away and back away from those cravings. Um, so I'm proud of myself. Make sure your water intake, another helpful tip. Um, you have to drink half your body weight in ounces. Divide your body weight in half, and that's how many ounces of water you have to drink, which is standard. However, I didn't realize this at first, that does not include all of the water 
in all of the shakes, which is almost 40 ounces of water between all the shakes you have. So that's an additional almost 40 ounces on top of half of your body weight. Just make sure you know that. It's a lot of water. Um, and make sure the meals, I had all the ingredients, I was going to do the carrot rock and salad. I had all the ingredients to make it for dinner and I didn't realize it had to sit in the fridge and marinate for like two or three hours. So that didn't happen that night. Um, but overall I did good. I mean, it gives you all the recipes. It gives you the exact serving of fruit and vegetable and healthy fat that you can have. It has guilt-free toppings that you can add um, to anything, put in your shakes or um, on your fruit and veggies. The vanilla shake on day two, I actually added blueberries because I could add it at the lunchtime. So I had blueberries and ice. Honestly, I liked it better plain. So I have had it plain the rest of the time. Um, yeah, so I'm pretty happy. Feel good. Slept good. I was not hungry at all. I had plenty of energy. Got right back into my workouts the next day. Did Pan DX3, done Pio. Feeling fine. And I maintained. I did not gain three pounds back. I checked. I was checking to see. So I've been maintaining and I've been sticking more with the healthy habits. Have I had some carbs? Yes. Okay. I have. But not like I used to. I've been having more shake shake allergies and fruit. I've been trying to eat better. So I enjoyed it. I'm proud of myself for doing it. I recommend it. I'm going to be starting a group to help those of you that want to give it a try. I'll put a link in the comments of the video. So go to the link or message me, um, whichever. If you have any questions, let me know. But that is my results of the three-day refresh. So thumbs up. All right. Bye.